Hello there, how are you? I hope all is well and everything is absolutely amazing on your end. Welcome back. This is your light in darkness and I am back again with another new update and important reading for all of you today. This reading is for divine soul connections meant for divine soul counterparts. So if you are in one then this reading may resonate with you or um, might apply. Okay? So today's reading is talking about a shift that has taken place in your soul connection at present. At present it seems that your soul counterpart is uh, inclined towards your soul connection or towards you in general. The old issues that were blocking your union don't seem to have that much power right now or uh, we can say that both of you are moving away from those issues or both of you are now headed towards a much better suited situation circumstance or outcome than you were before okay at present your counterpart is talking you to find out what you're doing or just to collect facts and information about your life as well as about a decision they have to make okay in respect to your soul connection and yours okay so i'm seeing that they are keeping tabs on you i'm seeing that they may have other people to keep eyes on to you or about what's going on in your life they might be stalking you on social media or in just some other way shape or form to know if you're single or with someone else or what's going on in your life or just to know how they can uh, reach out or do something to mend the bond between you two or change the situation that was there in the past this still little bit of ego and uh, pride within them which stops them from coming at you directly or in opening up or expressing how they feel but they are feeling this connection right now they are feeling what's there in between both of you or what was there they are feeling what is there in between both of you but they are still confused about their approach they are still confused about what they can do or should do to make things work out in between both of you as they know very well what happened in the past they know how they treated you they know how they have hurt you and uh, how horrible they were in the past they know that their words their actions their choices and decisions have hurt you a lot so it's not going to be that easy for them to come back in your life just like that so this is something which is uh, still in their head and this is something which still makes them uh, indecisive about reaching out to you or doing something making some sort of action they do want to they are planning they are looking into these matters but the thing is that they just don't know how to do it okay i hope you're getting my point some of them are just held back because of their own ego while others just know that it's not going to be easy and uh, maybe at first they'd have to face your wrath or uh, an outburst coming from you they do expect it or are assuming something like that and, and that is also something which is making them indecisive about their approach and taking any kind of action towards you okay so watch out if you see some sort of unusual activity happening around you or people coming out of the blue to ask you about your life and what you're doing these may turn out to be the same people your counterpart has asked or uh, appointed to keep eyes on you or to figure things out okay so i'm seeing that they want to change things in between the two of you they want to 
eliminate the causes of negativity fights arguments or any other darkness that was there hindering your soul connection in the past they want to eliminate all of that and they want to bring in a new beginning they want to start fresh with you and they want to choose this connection but the thing is that they just don't know how to do it okay they're watching you and they see that you are not much focused onto this connection as much as you're focused onto your purpose or just following your spiritual calling or life calling in general this is something which is attracting them towards you they find it very very attractive and uh, mesmerizing about you there's this mysterious element or vibe you're emitting which is influencing them to do better think better and act better in their life they want to follow the light like you are following your light they want to follow your lead as well some of them are looking into it so this is what is going on right now in their life they are not much inclined towards anyone else right now and at the same time i'm seeing that they are completely turned off from other people they don't want to look into them they don't want to know what it is they are doing they just don't want anything to do with anyone else except you right now and some of them are realizing that they were just stupid or ignorant to choose someone else over you this is the clarity they have received or the epiphany which has came through right now okay they are realizing that it was a mistake a blunder they made because there's no one like you there can never be someone like you in general the connection they share with you cannot be replaced or built with anyone else except you this is the clarity they are receiving or have received already and this is something which is helping them take action or make moves towards a better serious situation or circumstance which i see is leading them back towards you or just something which is going to be very very fruitful and it is related with a true soul connection not some kind of lustful uh, greed based need based toxic sexual connection i don't see that happening i'm seeing they are moving towards stability and abundance in a healthy manner they might be seeing number 11 11 right now they might be seeing signs about you quite often now more than usual this is something which is uh, intriguing them and filling them with a lot of curiosity and they are trying to figure things out they are looking into these articles or uh, these uh, topics which are piquing their interest right now but still as i said some of them are held back by their own ego as they don't want to face your wrath or get disrespected they are expecting or assuming that so this is one of the things which is blocking them while others are just confused about their approach as to how they can move towards you and bring this offer because they don't know where you stand and how you feel about them anymore as you seem to have this mysterious attitude or a detached state they are picking up from you so that is something they don't know how to fix or uh, move through or deal with but still i'm seeing things are going to work out somehow in some way shape or form these issues are not going to be there anymore they may find a way out or uh, something may just happen out of the blue through way of divine intervention which is going to fix everything or just fix this issue which is blocking this connection right now or in general this new beginning in whatever shape or form it is meant to come in your life or in both of your lives so i see that uh, reunion is possible may happen even if there's a blockage of someone's ego or someone being in too much pride someone holding on to anger or vengeance or someone being extremely bitter it can be you it can be them it can be anyone or just people in general who just do not want to see you to come back together as i see there are people who are looking at both of you and seeing that there's a huge possibility of you two coming back together and they are not happy about that so i think that that might be a blockage right now maybe possibly 
as i see people stalking both of you as i see people who may have caused separation in between you two or were the cause to see if things are working out in between the two of you or there's any hope they are trying to figure things out as well but i don't know if they have found something out or not i suggest that you keep things private and do not expose or uh, explain anything to anyone right now keep things hidden keep things in secret and just let god unfold anything and everything according to your divine plan as i see them as well feeling confused and uh, perplexed about how things are working out for both of you or in your life in general about this connection on respect to your connection okay so there are people who are hateful and jealous and envious of your success or the growth that you are experiencing right now or might experience in the near future so keep things hidden as i said already don't disclose anything to anyone keep moving forward and just expect wonderful changes to unfold in your life sooner than later you don't even have to show anything to your counterpart let them wonder a bit let them feel confused to figure a way out on their own that way things are going to work out okay focus on your work focus on building yourself focus on healing yourself and remaining true to your own self no matter what is happening let people feel jealous envious or whatever they'd like to feel it won't make even an inch of a difference with the abundance that is about to enter in your life okay so hope for the best and just expect wonderful amazing blessings to get showered upon you or just enter within this uh, troubling dynamic you are experiencing related with your soul connection i see healing happening i am seeing uh, things just working out for you in general okay these issues won't even be there for much longer and uh, there's a new beginning unfolding okay so that's all this was your reading i hope you enjoyed listening to me and and this brought you the clarity you were seeking and were hoping to get if so do let me know how you felt in the comment section below feel free to hit the like button and do subscribe to our channel for more such content to be readily available for all of you on a regular basis with that being said do not hesitate to follow through with the link given in the description box below if your heart says so also if any of you are interested in taking a personal life purpose reading kindly contact me or consult with me through way of my given email address provided in the description box below that's all i'll be back sooner than later till then take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye